Hello, in this tutorial guide, I'm going to cover how to create your Google Sheet, find the Google Sheets you're working with, and how to check if your information is saved in the Google Sheet. So the first step uh, in anything with Google is to make sure that you are signed in to Google by going to www.google.com. And in the upper right hand corner, you are signed in with your Gmail account. Now, one way to access your Google Sheets is to simply go to the top right corner and click on the app grid where it says Google Apps and find wherever Sheets is located um, in the grid by scrolling down and then you can click on Sheets. It will take you into Google Sheets and this is where you can create a blank one or you can go to the template gallery uh, and find one that will work for what you're wanting to use a sheet for. Um, another way to access Google Sheets is to simply go to the top URL bar and type in sheets.google.com and hit enter uh, and it'll take you there as well. So you don't have to search for the Sheets icon in the app grid in the top right corner. Now once you're in the Sheets uh, program, you're going to see that you can search for Sheets that you worked on today and you can look at sheets that you worked on um, in the previous uh, days and months and years. Um, you also have the opportunity to go and sort by owned by me or owned by anyone. Um, you also have the opportunity to sort by title A to Z. You also can do last, hold on a second, you can also do last modified um, uh, as well. And then you can also switch to grid view if you want to see the image of your Google Sheet versus the list um, with all the names of your Google Sheets. All right, so with that, I'm just going to create a, a new blank one right now. And to name your Google Sheet, you click in the top left and you give it a, a name. I'm going to call this demo name. And then right now, notice it says saving and then it says all changes saved in Drive. That means that now I can close this tab right now and if I go back to Sheets, um, it should show um, that sheet that I just created. It'll appear right here on the list. Um, let's go by Owned by Me and let's go Last Modified and it says Demo Name. So if I click on it, there's the sheet I created. Um, note, if you don't see a folder or a star and you don't see last edit was a second ago, then you know it didn't save. Now watch if I type example, example, I'm just typing random things into this cell. Google is not saving anything right now like it would a Google Doc. So if I hit the X right now in this tab, that information is gone. So watch as I go back to that sheet and I open it up. Um, this is a different um, feature than Google Docs, because Google Docs would save each keystroke. Note that it didn't actually take that keystroke. But if I come in here and type example, example, and then I hit enter, note it's saying saving. All changes are now saved. So if I close that tab and I go back to Sheets and look at it, you'll see that it saved what I did. Um, this is just important because you may be someone who's new to Google and not know that in Google Sheets, it's different than Google Docs, that it's not an actual keystroke that it's saving. It's saving whatever input you put in the cell and then go enter it into that cell. Um, so just something I wanted to showcase. All right, thank you so much for watching this video. The next uh, videos will go step by step in the other formulas, tools, and functions that I showcased in the overall uh, video I created. Thank you so much for watching.